updates from day two of the solar energy training program. Yesterday, 250 youth began their journey to acquire skills in solar energy. And today, being the second day, they delved into the fundamentals of solar installation, repairs, and maintenance. Mr. Katawan Boniface, former DG, campaign of Senator Binos Yero, explained what the senator is doing and what he intends to achieve. And this is the second, second edition, about uh, 250 participants are uh, now been trained. Uh, I think uh, based on what is happening globally, everybody is trying to install solar in his house or at the working place. So I think uh, we just decide to impact this knowledge to youths and that is what he's doing currently. Mr. Mohamed Yakamata of Alcaf Global Resources Limited highlighted their partnership with the National Directorate of Employment, NDE, and Senator Yaroy. He bared his mind on the impact the training will have on the youth and implored the beneficiaries not to sell the tools that will be given to them, but rather to make judicious use of them. Yes, actually, I've seen this program as a life-changing program that is uh, aimed at touching the lives of people and making the youth to be self-reliant. We are here in partnership with the Nigerian Directorate of Employment, NDE, to anchor this program to uh, train youth on PV solar technologies as a way of making them to be self-reliant and to acquire skills that will impact on uh, their lives and make them self-sufficient. The senator has been so wonderful to us. He has, he has been so nice to us and he has always been there for us and uh, we've never failed him in any way. My advice to the beneficiaries or the participants of this uh, training is to use the skills they've acquired from this training to utilize it in a better way. They should not just see it as a medium where they will just come and collect stipend and go. They should try as much as possible to put this in practice as that will help them and then the lives of their families and the society at large. We are calling on the participants of this initiative, of this program. They should please see this as a, as a privilege. There are so many others out there, they have not gotten this opportunity. They should see this as a privilege and try to make use of this privilege in such a way that it will better their lives and the lives of the society at large. Because actually some people are fond of, after getting the tools, they will just go and sell them off, which is, which is very, very abnormal and it's not proper. Because for the senator to come up with such initiative, he really has his people at heart and he really means well for, for his people. And he has always been there. There are so many other projects he has executed, executed towards changing the lives of uh, the Adama South Senatorial uh, District. These 250 youths will gain hands-on experience, enhancing their employability, contributing to sustainable development in their communities. Senator Binos Yaro's solar energy initiative shines bright, eliminating pathways for Adamawa's future leaders. Caleb Zadok, reporting for Eagle Lenses TV.